Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports News Briefing for Tuesday the 13th of August. The local media headlines today. Plans to make cycling safer to the west of Truro could make some significant progress this week and next as Cornwall Council puts the finishing touches to a series of proposals for bicycle-only routes. The most eye-catching part of the scheme would be a new flyover for cyclists to cross the Chiverton Cross roundabout on the A30. The upgrade is part of the proposed dual carriageway to improve the A30 to Carland Cross. The BBC was one of several media to report the opening of a new medical centre in Penzance. The St Clair Centre cost £6 million and will cater for 21,000 patients. Pirate FM had an update on the condition of a 12-year-old boy badly hurt in a crash on the Lizard. He was flown to Derriford Hospital after two cars collided. The Cornish Times looks forward to a meeting on Thursday which will hear more details about plans for integrating health and social care. Those plans have already seen the minor injury unit at Saltash moved to Liscard. The Camelford and Delibold Post told us about a bit of a rumpus between the town and Cornwall councils over the state of a local car park. The Cornish and Devon Post reported an update on what happens to Launston's waste and recycling. And finally, Cornwall Live is looking forward to the week's weather. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye bye.